so then we will have to uh, sometimes if you are not going to treat him he is going to end up with some other doctor or some other quack even so better we take care of that at least what uh, the panel is told he will be given proper care rest and not, totally you can see that is this one and he does not end up in something else so but as a scientist we have to observe all these things whether that was required or not okay it was required because of the demand of the patient that you have to agree ayurvedic modalities of treatment this is the big list of treatments which we can take or do either individually or uh, package or totally together here also thanks to sushruta i am also leaning towards the shashti rubakramas of vrana chikitsa treatment principles of vata vyadi bhagna marma vigada shofa rana basically this is the only thing which we are doing, dealing any any treatment which we are Uh, applying to the patient with cervical spondylolisthesis has to fall in this category if there is anything else of course, of course the uh, psychological part of it now the treatment sometimes starts with apadarpana only simply we have already told about that if there is amatvam and there is gauravatvam in the body and because of the travel overnight from chennai to coimbatore or from coimbatore to chennai it is there then sometimes and compounded with anidra as well as the shake of the you are not getting a volvo bus but something else so then <laughs> that if it is then rest and proper and you had in fact a roots and seva you the bus stopped at three what you call somewhere near e road you got down and had very dry biryani only and no water in between you felt thirsty you did not get water so amatva develops or uh, then you have there langana only whether so now i am put, telling this a little in uh, detail because you can learn cervical spondylosis whether langana is on i am telling about the presentation of the patient cervical spondylosis whether it has established but everyone you see that now in the current scene 23 year old male or female 22 year old male or female going with neck pain to an orthopedician first thing it is done is that no counseling nothing is done and x ray is taken and told that at 20 it is we all have to know that 20 21 is the age of completion of ossification in some it goes up to 24 also at that time there is a declaration from the orthopedician that unga yell change pochu alle yell ningada disc on cherdai change poi then what else so as number of ways whether we should take that in that sense is the thing so when we know that that is where we succeed also come that karpura tayla matram if we apply and then he is okay so apatarpana chikitsa don't take it in uh, so with a sense that uh, i am telling that okay cervical spondylosis occurs in the stomach it is occurring where it is but this is a modality of treatment like that we can say that alepana we come to the lepas which will be told parishega is sometimes used abhyanga we know swedana different types of swedana vimlapana whether we use that very good results this is where they told about the they told about the trigger points where there is hard myofascial swellings they told about uh, the previous speaker told about the um, what you call knotty feeling in the muscles the muscle feels to be knotted when you palpate there is hard stony mass like structure and it's very painful but once you do vimlapana over there naturally the next day the patient usually you are trying to dissolve or resolve there and re establish the proper circulation and relax the muscles or relieve the muscle spasm and the patient is okay so vimlapana i consider that idu tirumallu korchu varuna karyam ഈ വരലുകൊണ്ട് തിരുമ അവർ കളർ ചികിത്സയിലൊക്കെ വരുന്ന അപ്പോൾ കട്ടിയുള്ള അവർ തൊട്ടാൽ ഇതുള്ള ഭാഗത്ത് വരുമ്പോൾ ടു ഗിവ് എ വിമ്ലാപ്പന ലൈക്ക് മൂവ്മെൻറ്റ് ഇറ്റ് ഈസ് ഡോൾഡ് മർദ്ദന ഹാസ് വിനോ ഹാർഡ് മസാജ് ഉപ്പന ഹാസ് വെരി വണ്ടർഫുൾ റിസൾട്ട് ഐ തിങ്ക് ഡോക്ടർ രവീന്ദ്രൻ ആൾസോ വിൽ അഗ്രി മെനി ടൈംസ് വിസിറ്റിംഗ് മെനി ഡോക്ടേഴ്സ് ത്രീ ബാഗ്സ് ഓഫ് എക്സറേസ് എം ആർ ഐസ് യു വി പുട്ട് എ ഉപ്പന ഹാ ഓഫ് ആർ നോട്ട് ഉപ്പന ഹാ to that extent but leba upanaha means we try to cover it with uh, uh, this one also to prevent the escape of the heat there we get wonderful results 
with Nagaradi Chorna, with Ramayadi Chorna sometimes, with Patanjali Chorna. We'll come to those agents later. Neha Bana, Virechana, Virechana, whether it is useful, still that is also, we have to consider whenever it is Mamsa Gata only. So whether, uh, again, don't get confused that cervical spondylosis, Mamsa Gata, now what we are talking about is Hasti and Kasheru. No, there can be presentation, I am telling, of the clinician, clinic, uh, patient. There is Anchana. We already told traction. Anchana is not a new thing from modern physiotherapy which we have to buy or uh, exchange or anything. It is there in our own treatment principles. Bandhana. Bandhana cervical collar we were talking about. It's a, it's a sort of bandhana only which is being given, included under the 14 types of bandhana which is told. Veshtana. Again, side managing. The difference between bandhana and Veshtana you know. Kapadasayana, it is again flat bed rest which is advised sometimes as a first upashaya itself. You just take flat bed rest without any of this thing. Snehavasti, Kashayavasti, when the extent of the stone is into the Gambhira Dhatus, Nasya, Murdataila, Vamana. Vamana is also told as a treatment principle which we have already mentioned over here. Some Samana Aushadis, as we have been telling about Kashaya, Saila Prayogas, inside, outside, etc. Asti Majja Dhatu Vriddhi Gara Chikitsa, that has been already already told, but there is some more explanation why uh, Grita has to be, Grita or Sira has compounded with Gugulu is, uh, with uh, Sikta Dravyas is more useful, because it attributes for the Siratva, Kadinatva and Snigdhatva of the there is no single drug like that available in the universe. If there was a single drug, Acharya would have told it in the uh, Agriyavashtada Ghana. But such a thing is not there. You can go through that Sarvanga Sundari Vyakhyana in Asthivardhi Chikitsa, Asthi Chaya Chikitsa regarding that. Now, this is the gist of the presentation. Classification of patients for Ayurvedic treatment. If it is useful, I think you can adapt it. If it has to be reformed, I think I will be the most happiest person if we get input into it so that we can have a protocol for the different things over there. Acute onset, the patient comes with acute onset. The treatment which has to be adopted is Bhakna Chikitsa, that is first thing is immobilization, uh, uh, what you call, uh, if there is any ch chance of this one, the principles of uh, fracture management is reduction, immobilization and rest. Marma Abhigada Chikitsa, sometimes that pain is so severe that Marma Abhigada Lakshanas, Samoha Lakshanas also will be there. So, keeping the patient or uh, bringing back the patient to normal, this one. Show for Chikitsa, here anti-inflammatory treatment which was already told, maybe Lepa, etc. This only will suffice in a patient with acute onset of this one. But you know that I am not telling about just osteoporosis proper, I am telling about all the neck conditions which we may infer that may be due to cervical spondylosis. Gradual onset, typical Vata Vyadi Chikitsa has to be used. Gradual development but sudden onset. See sometimes the Vyadi has set in gradually and the onset is sudden. There are two situations like that. One is like that. Another thing is that on sudden onset on a chronic condition. It will be chronic, it will be known case, it will be, he will be very happy, but someday he comes with this problem. And it is, the first thing again, what is added in that is that he is bothered now. Already you treated me sir, it was all okay. Now, whether there is a, why the resurgence is there, or why there is a uh, relapse of that complaint. Muhur, what you call that sir, uh, the previous lecture can compared it to Muhur, Muhur, more uh, Mohutum of the Vyadi etc. A combination of the above treatments will have to be done. A judicious combination. Vata Vyadi Chikitsa has to be continued. Asti Majja Vardhi Gara Chikitsa has to be continued. Along with that, when the sudden onset occurs, sometimes that will have to be given an interval and then the acute, whatever treatment you do for the acute condition will have to be intervened. After that again, you will have to go in for so, recurrent all the above plus Balya, Sairyagara, Astu Dadu Chayahara and even Rasayana Chikitsas will have to be included over there.
this is a totally degenerative condition where recurrent episodes are occurring it is never healing it has gone to the yapyavastha the vyadhi margatvam the yapyatvam has already been mentioned where we may have to go in for even consider rasayana chikitsa in such conditions some common prayogas manyasthamba for manyasthamba what uh, usually valugas vedha rukshas vedha podikiri and uh, nasya that is anutaila nasya etc are used i am just giving suggestions you all practitioners out of your uh, i interest out of your exposure out of your experience would have gained a lot which may be the thing which we will do after the session for 5 to 10, 10 minutes bahu shosha grata pana especially kalyana grata has been mentioned remember that bahu shosha in uh, you think in chakra data grata pana has been mentioned especially kalyana grata pana has been mentioned so yeah, remember that uh, when we stu- we would have studied it in uh, uh unmada chikitsa only but there is a particular reference of where the where you can see that once it is told then there is a inference that this simple bahu shula or manya shula can cause for the patient a, a very very nagging psychological situation that's what we have to so that's why we tell that the vata vyadi is as vata vatam has gone that much that it has happened it is reflecting much more sushma manasa so uh, that's why i included that simply any other krutas also can be used abavahu ka sneha bana uttara bhaktika prayoga has been told outara bhaktikam outara bhaktikam that is a sneha prayoga snehana prayoga uh, antar prayoga but the time has been told uttara bhaktikam we know that that is due to the delivery it has to be on the site if it is taken before it will be effective more in the adakaya if it is taken later it will be this one so avashada kala has to be remembered when you will do it for udana vata then you will be doing it for dhyana vata vishwaji there is a uh, special procedure mentioned uh, as nasa pana so i have heard that also but i i am not very uh, very convinced or very uh, attracted to it i will tell you plainly nasa pana in mysore college and all they do Uh, actually i was talking to when this was being prepared i was talking to dr arati she has graduated from there so dr anjaney murthy and all uh, does that with prasarani kashaya chirakavada and all nasa pana is done it seems the kashaya is given through the nose but i believe that nasa pana may be a voluminous amount of nasya uh, prayoga is what is indicated i believe i don't know uh, Vishwaji, Nasabana, Kashaya of Dashamula, Bala and Masha with Taila and Girtha added to it. That is what is told. I think Dr. Keshwan can give some insight to it. Medicines already we have talked about. And I think time is also ending. Rasna Sattagam Kashaya, Rasna Yarandadi Kashaya. See, almost there will be, as I told, even, even though there may be difference of opinion, but there will be categorization of the medicines. based on the treatment we all have studied ayurveda only we all have studied ayurveda try to understand ayurveda from the basic principles of ayurveda so there will be some area common area only when we are prescribing maybe due to our anubhava due to our uh, teachers uh, uh, influence we will be using uh, particular set of drugs here also i put it in that way only rasna satang kashaya rasna randadi kashaya in acute uh, what do you call ama avastha sama avastha condition with the particular uh, gugulu preparation or uh, uh, the pachana dravya which it is required prasaranya vikashaya that is prasaranya vi actually has to be I, uh, i have understood that it has to be used only as chirakwala it is not suggested like gugulu tiktam kashaya is a uh, what do you call uh, uh, innovative this one but gugulu tiktam gritam is the yoga mentioned and it has to be Indugandam Gritha again like that. Indugandam Kashaya, okay, now we have a new formula. We cannot tell that that is the same as Indugandam this one. So, Prasaranya the Kashaya, which is Shira Bhoji means, it has to be Shira Kashaya with Shira Bhojana is what I feel. And that is more required as already explained in wherever there is Mylopathy is present, wherever there is demyelination which is present, wherever there is fatty tissue de- uh, degeneration, fatty uh, layer of the nerve which has been affected, that will be affected. Next. Danvandran Kashaya and Maharasnadi Kashaya, you know that they have from Abhigada to, it can cover from Abhigada to 
very gross uh, Purana Vata Vyadis it can cover. Maharasana Dikasha. Gugulu Yogas, there are particular yogas like Prayodashanga Gugulu, where uh, what do you call uh, even Eranda Thaila is mixed. There is Simhanada Gugulu, there is Abha Gugulu in the later stage, there is uh, what do you call Laksha Gugulu. So all these things which are then we have the this one of Yogaraja, Maha Yogaraja Gugulus, which can be according to the situation selected and used. Then Maharaja Prasarani Thailam is the very, very common Thailam which is used maybe because our teachers were using it more, Maharaja Prasarani Thailam. Dhanvandran Thailam, Avartida Dhanvandran Thailam, Shirabala Thailam, all these things can be useful in the later part I told now, in recurrent very degenerated cases. Again, Gandha Thaila can be of very good use. I have, if I have missed the, uh, uh, what do you call, Adhibala Thaila, uh, what do you call, uh, this, uh, what do you call, the survey loan I heard that it is um, Bala Thaila, Adhibala, uh, what do you call, Mahabala Thaila. It's a combination like Mahabala Thaila is what I heard. So, they can be used. Externally, see that we started with Prasaranyadi Thailam itself, stiffness removing one. We told about uh, in Chikitsa, we told about this Murivanna. I have not put it here, already mentioned. Murivanna in acute stage. Murivanna, as uh, we all have to think about that, Murivanna is as told, it is having Chatavari as the Kalka. And so that is why it Chadoshma, it, it is useful more in that avastha than in very chronic vata, vata vyadis. But another area of Thailam is the Ashavanna which we are having. Don't be uh, anxious that we don't have Ashavanna. We have to go in search of the Siddha store for uh, uh, getting Ashavanna. If you simply use Parnavagiriya the Thailam, Chinja the Thailam, Masha Saindava Sadhidan Thailam. See, there are also choices there. When you use Masha Saindava if the stiffness is associated with neurological. This one, it is better Masha sign though. Masha, Maha Masha Thaila. If it is just inflammatory, Chinjadi will be better. If there is inflammatory with stiffness, Paranadagariyadi will be better. So that etc, 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 because it is endless, we know that different schools we have come from, different Prayogas are there. And so, please excuse me for that two extras, extra. Medicines continued, Kotan Chukadi Churnam, Jadamayadi Churnam, very, very useful things in clinical practice. Again, I tell that those patients may not be totally diagnosed as cervical spondylitic, but reporting with pain and stiffness of the neck and, and pain radiating to the uh, uh, limb, affecting their normal routine procedure of life. ADL we are telling, on that day I did not explain about what ADL, ADL is activities of daily living. How far a complaint is affecting the ADL? So ADL can be restored. Marma Guliga is used. The Cherya Marma Guliga is much more this one because it has the opium in it, which is now very difficult to get. Karatha Vatta, which we usually use for Shirastoda, that also what you call with particular Kumari Swarasa or uh, with uh, what you call uh, Kumari Niriyasa with water, with egg white sometimes. All these things are useful. Whenever we are putting it for anti-inflammatory, better we can make it, as told in Upanaha, more Amla Yukta, more Lavana Yukta. These are all the Yuktis which we have to use. Somebody, uh, uh, where I differ is that um, somebody, if they tell that you can apply this, Muruvanna is very effective, uh, Marmaguliga is very effective. So, uh, Muruvanna, grind Muruvanna in, uh, what you call, Marmaguliga in Muruvanna and apply, that will be a illogical Application is what I believe. Valuga Sweda, Jambira Penda Sweda is selectively used sometimes. Naringa Kiri. Dhanyamla Sweda, Dhanyamla Sweda, it's an improvisation only. The same Podikiri, uh, what you call uh, Dhanyamla is boil. And in that Bhashpa, the uh, Dhanya Kiri is or Podikiri is uh, heated and then applied. So the, uh, sometimes you can go into that extent that you can apply it immersed into the uh, this one is like ba, Shashtika Penda in Balakwada. You can immerse this particular in uh, Dhanyamla, hot Dhanyamla, and then go for this one. Dhanyamla Dhara can be done, especially in these areas. 
സുവർണ പിണ്ടസ്വേത പത്രപോർള സ്വേത വി വെരി വെൽ നോ ദറ്റ് ഷാഷ്ടിക പിണ്ടസ്വേത ഇൻ പത്രപോർള സ്വേത ആൻഡ് ഓൾ വി മേക്ക് സം ലിറ്റിൽ ചേഞ്ചസ് ലൈക്ക് ഇൻസ്റ്റെഡ് ഓഫ് ജസ്റ്റ് ചതാഹ ദിസ് വൺ ആൻഡ് ഓൾ ആഡ് ഫിഫ്റ്റി ഗ്രാംസ് ഓഫ് കൊട്ടൻ ചുക്കാതി ചൂർണ ഇറ്റ് സെൽഫ് സോ ദാറ്റ് യു ഗെറ്റ് ബെറ്റർ വിത്ത് ലവണ മോർ ഓഫ് ലവണ ഇറ്റ് വിൽ ഗെറ്റ് ഗീവ് ദി ഇറ്റ് വിൽ ചേഞ്ച് ദി ക്വാളിറ്റി ഓഫ് ദി പത്രപോർള വെൻ ടു ഹാവ് അവർ അച്ചീവ്മെന്റ് ഡൺ ഓൾ നസ്യ അണുതൈല ഇൻ ദി ഫസ്റ്റ് സ്റ്റേജസ് ആൻഡ് ക്ഷീരബലാദി തൈലസ് ഇൻ ദി നെക്സ്റ്റ് സ്റ്റേജ് മൂർദ തൈല കാർപസ്വസ്ഥതി തൈലം ഇസ് യൂസ് ക്ഷീരബല തൈലം ഇസ് യൂസ് ശുദ്ധബല തൈലം ഇസ് യൂസ് ഇൻ കവവാദജ കണ്ടീഷൻസ് വി കാൻ ഗോ ഇൻ ഫോർ അസന വിൽവാദി അസന ഏലാദി ലൈക്ക് ത്രിഫലാദി ലൈക്ക് തൈലാസ് ഓൾസോ ഫോർ അഭ്യങ്ക പിജു ആൻഡ് സേഗ പിജു ഓൾസോ സംടൈംസ് ആർ ഹെൽപ്ഫുൾ വെൻ യു ആർ ഡൂയിങ് അഭ്യങ്ക അപ്ലൈ എ പിജു ആൻഡ് ദെൻ എസ്പെഷ്യലി ഫോർ പേഷ്യൻസ് കംപ്ലൈനിങ് അബൌട്ട് ഇൻസോമിയ ഓൾസോ Then, uh, Sega is very good then, uh, Shiro Vasti I did not mention because that is, you know, that, that is the difficulty for the patients. Then, uh, Sega is very good then, Shiro Vasti I did not mention because that is, you know, that is the difficulty for the patients. Sega is very useful because it is very comforting for the patients. Talam, already Nirarakam was told. So, the first prescription usually is Talam with Jambira Swarasa with Rasnadi Churna. There are two options again here. Those patients who are... Uh, paithiga little paithiga we know that when they talk when they come and talk to us itself we know that they are a little shubida and so their rasnadi churna is not usually used kachuradi churna is used jambira sarsa is not used but just water is used so th- those are practical uh, changes which we can make in this now with that i think uh, we have finished the this one i am just mentioning about options in modern medicine which might have been already told which many a times what we are doing is similar to that rest medication orthosis is something like orthotic uh, uh, appliances exercises whenever it has to be manipulation and massage surgery so surgery is a requirement sometimes all the cases we will not be able to manage when there is intractable pain the patient is suffering we will not be uh, we have tried all our conservative methods it will not be possible Uh, like that last week i referred one of the patients he cannot he has habituated himself since the last 6 months uh, of taking 2 ml uh, diclofenac with 1 ml of betanasol whenever he gets pain the patient compulsorily he told that i want to get admitted i was trying to prevent him second day i had to discharge him. i had to give a push rather for the night because he was struggling like anything next next morning i told that better you go for uh, this one but before that he has gone to uh, what do you call specialist consultation they have advised also proper things but he has to run his maligai shop so he was going on taking this injection and this one so his tolerance had gone down to that level and he was almost psychic uh, so surgery is also sometimes required an inter- intervention which will be saving the situation musculoskeletal physical therapy i am very much sure that a question was arise of what modern physiotherapy or physiotherapy methods can this one many a things which we are doing are unknowingly physiotherapy of course i always tell that cattle bone syriacs method cattle bones method there are mckenzie's method there are many things explained here sorry we don't have that documentation or we don't have that we never felt the need for that so that we don't have any raman method krishnan method or <laughs> any other method being documented even sometimes something is being done in mysore in kr nagar pyriformis technique correction technique maybe in chronic cases it will not work well but in this one but we are not we are still uh, very very reluctant to accept that it gives relief to many patients it is giving that manipulative method is giving this one what scientifically is happening that's what we have to explain what has happened is that we are very very skeptic about our own our local health tradition handling people bone setters masseurs they may be doing wrong with their ignorance but something which is done by them which is good for the society which is good for the patient good for the science that we will have to refine and accept that's what i will have to tell so orthopedic manual therapy calorie massage procedures so in this myotherapy massage manipulation massage is one type of manipulation only but here other types of manipulation are told massage methods etc i will just mention one more thing the clinical success of massage because that is an area which i am very interested that's uh, 
area by massage, different types of massages in painful conditions we are able to give relief and sometimes as claimed for survey loan, I used to talk to or uh, this uh, particular oil, I used to claim with all the Kaya Chikitsa, maybe my, with my wife Dr. Ayrthi itself, what you do within 21 days, we will do within 7 days in some conditions because Thirumal or Tadaval has so much of effect. Whenever the cause is physical, we have to intervene physically. Whenever it is what you call, uh, otherwise Nija Vyadis, you will have to intervene with medicines only, medicines and food only. But there, wherever there is a physical cause, and when we know that cervical spondylosis or cervical conditions have a physical factor which is very relevant, massage, Tadaval, Thirumal, everything has a very good, this one. But the thing is that the clinical success of massage and soft tissue manipulation has often eluded scientific explanation. This is what we are trying to get into. The inability to provide scientific verification for these treatment procedures has unfortunately resulted in professional skepticism which undermines the credibility of this form of therapy. But because I, uh, I belong to that varga, I always advocate for it that it should be done very judiciously. Whether now three warnings regarding these things in manipulation, whether pain is referred from other sources, whether multiple levels are there or any neurological cause is there, severe unrelenting pain is there, you should not do massage, there may be a tumor or an infection. Three major disorders to exclude inflammatory disorders, any other fever related, uh, this one you should exclude, vertebral tumors once found, don't go in for massage manipulation, narrow tumors, don't uh, feel that they are uh, just myofascial uh, nodules to be done with Vimlapana with or anything, <laughs> so that is something. And realities also I will come into, most symptoms of IVDP in cervical spondylosis are self-limiting, give the required time, give the required rest, remove the anxiety of the patient, attend on him medically properly, relieve the physical discomfort, they may be self-limiting, resolve spontaneously, that is what was told. Many of the interventions are not needed, they are all spontaneously recovering like, but we cannot, patient cannot, I, if I am a patient, I will not sit happily that if somebody tells that, okay, after three months your neck pain will go, means I will not be satisfied, I will not rest also, that is not true also, because three days with, uh, uh, what do you call, three months with that pain, thinking that it will resolve is foolishness. So, in any way medical intervention has to be done and uh, uh, even though they resolve spontaneously, we have to only bear in mind that there is a chance of result, spontaneous resolution. Not that what all I did alone worked for the patient, the patients, OGES patients, the Adi Shamatan, the patients, Bhala itself has worked towards correcting the symptoms. That is why maybe not due to our treatment. Well. Time is the healer. In many of these musculoskeletal complaints, time is a healer. Power of human body to heal itself, not to be underestimated. That is why without medicine, sometimes massages also work. Everything we do is to direct and facilitate this process which assists the nature is what I believe. That is the gist of Ayurvedic treatment I believe. Thank you.